rational numbers as we know what are the rational numbers let's see again uh, we just have a quick recap of the rational numbers so as you all know that if a number we write it in a form of p by q if a number is written like p upon q where q is not equals to 0 where q is not equals to 0 why q is not equals to 0 because if we put 0 here in denominator we do not know how to divide by 0 that is why we say that q should not be equals to 0 so any number written in the form of the p by q is called a rational number now we know what are the addition subtraction procedures of uh, rational numbers now we will go through the properties of the addition subtraction multiplication and division of rational numbers so first let's see addition of rational numbers so here first we will talk about the closure property what does the closure property says that the rational number plus rational number should be a rational number if this is done then a closure property will be followed so let's see we take a rational number 2 upon 3 and another rational numbers 1 upon 3 now how to add a rational number as we know that if denominators are equal if denominators are same then we just add this means 2 plus 1 upon 3 that equals to 3 upon 3 and this is 1 and 1 can be written as 1 upon 1 which is a rational number or let's take in another example we want to add 1 plus 1 by 4 plus 1 by 3 as this 1 by 4 and 1 by 3 are of different denominator so what is the procedure to add them first make the denominator same so to make the denominator same we make this 1 by 4 as multiply by 3 this and for 1 by 3 we do this so here we have 3 by 12 plus 4 by 12 and now we can say the denominators are same so just add the numerators and we have 7 by 12 here so here we can see addition of two rational number is a rational number again so we can say that rational numbers follow the closure property on the addition because they add, they add them uh, when we add them we get a rational number So we can say closure property is followed by addition on rational numbers. Let's see the another property which is commutative property. Commutativity. Now what does the commutativity say that A plus B should be equals to B plus A. This is the commutativity. So let's see in the rational numbers does this follow the commutativity. So let's take two examples. The first example is 3 by 8 plus 1 by 8. Now 3 by 8 plus 1 by 8, we can see that denominators are same. So the addition can be done on just on numerator. So 4 plus 1 by 8, that means it's 3 plus 1 by 8. It is 4 by 8 and in the lowest form this can be written as 1 by 2 because 4 will cancel out 8 so at addition of two rational number a rational number we know as well the closure property now if we add this 
like in this order again we will have 1 by 3 plus 8 that means 4 by 8 and in the lowest form it is 1 by 2 so we change the order 